Today is the final video in this mini braids series. I'll be showing you all the growth I've received, also showing some measurements, having worn mini braids on my natural hair for, for the last 12 weeks. Let's go ahead and get into today's video. Welcome and welcome back to all my new and returning subscribers. I really appreciate each and every one of you stopping by my channel and checking out my content. Thank you so, so much for being here. I really appreciate you all. So this is my hair after 12 weeks. I'm so, so excited, honestly, to take this out and to finally see my hair. It's been a long time coming. I wanted to also say a big thank you and a big shout out to everyone who's participated in the challenge those who've commented down below to show me some support and to spur me on to give you the motivation to keep these in and i say thank you to all of you all that's been watching and been following along this challenge as stated before i've found mini braids a great way of growing my natural hair and i've created tons of playlists on all the challenges that i've done this year 2023 has been a year of lots of hair growth challenges on this channel you can check out my playlist section you can follow along anytime you like starting and putting your own end dates in and you can grow your natural hair along with me here on this channel in one of my previous videos i talk about the benefits of wearing mini braids which in brief is that they're cheap um that they last a long time that you're able to get lots of growth um you could check out that video as well but i also spoke about the drawbacks of having mini braids on your natural hair they do take a long time to put in you can get knots and tangles from them you can get lock from them and various things but overall i feel, feel like this is a great way of growing your natural hair as i've seen i've seen the growth and i'm showing the growth hair as evidence that mini braids can grow your natural hair subscribe to my youtube channel i'm growing my natural hair hair and i'll be doing that in 2024 lots coming up for 2024 lots of changes to be made to the regimen and things like that and i'll be sharing that all on the channel so how do i feel 12 weeks in uh, 12 weeks in i feel like it's time to take these down i'm so excited to take them down my hair looks really really good and as i said i'm been getting like a feeling for locking my hair and as i see it like this I get an idea of what my 12 week locks would look like um probably if i started with braids so that's really exciting in week 11 i did show you that i redid the front of my hair and i've redone the front of my hair a few times for the last three months because i needed to look presentable and so that's why the front has some twists in so i'm just going to do some random measurements here now i'm going to make some disclaimers my hair broke a lot uh, at the front at the last one of my last takedown that which is very discouraging so I know probably my lens retention in the front won't be great um so i'm just going to measure now how much growth i've actually received on this challenge so it looks like i've got about two inches or just under two inches at the front now that's fantastic for just keeping my hair in for three months as you know i've stated before on this channel that i'm a slow hair grower my hair takes ages to grow i have been using virgin fertilizer although not so much uh, in this challenge which has helped me and given me a little bit more growth but I, I think two inches is fantastic to add that along with all the other growth that I received um, from the previous challenges I think that's really really good so as I measure another area there it's just under two inches again a lot a lot of new growth hair with using mini braids to grow your natural hair I'm showing you where it's loose that's all the hair you can actually see the growth if you look closely all the growth that's there I'm um, showing up from my scalp you can see how it looks puffy and that's all the growth I've received in the last 12 weeks now depending on your hair growth rate you might be seeing three four inches because there's a lot of ladies that get more than an inch a month and so i hope you were one of those fast hair growers and you've got plenty more hair growth than i do but i'm really really happy with this amount of growth knowing that i am a slow hair grower the thing will be here to have length retention to be able to keep all of this length on which has been my problem because my hair is high porosity porosity it breaks easily i've been using henna to try and bond my hair together to make it not break as much but I have, I have been experiencing a lot of breakage and so I'm going to factor that in probably when it comes to doing my overall length measurement, health check measurement at the end of the year. And once again, I'm showing you there just above my ears, I've got two inches of growth, which is great. Now I'll be very, very excited to hear from you how much growth you've got. Comment down below, put the numbers in and let me see that. I'm so motivated from hearing or from all my subscribers in the comments when I read the comments. So please 
the comments have been going down in the past few weeks and i really love to hear from you anything any questions that you have pop them down below also give this video a like and also hit the notification bell when you subscribe so that you know when i post videos this channel is dedicated to helping you to grow your natural hair long if like myself you've never had long hair before perhaps you did have long hair before and you're just looking for easy simple ways of growing your natural hair this is what this channel is for just simply dedicated to growing your natural hair it's also focusing on growth so as we go into the new year and as i've been promising content on personal growth um name change coming up as well so much exciting stuff coming up in 2024 but the main bulk of this channel will still focus on growing our natural hair okay so let's continue along with the measurements making sure that we get all the measurements in i like to do these measuring videos because i'm going to do some side by side comparisons and um, sometimes it's good to see the measurement to review my regimen to see how that regimen particularly panned out on maybe affected my growth i was washing my hair weekly check out my wash day playlist i have created a loose wash day playlist in my playlist section talking to, to you about each step of washing your hair on wash day and that's got uh, lots of information on there but i've just shown you there i actually managed to get two just over two inches from the side of my hair and that is really encouraging i've said before also that different lengths different parts of my hair grow at different lengths so that's not surprising at all that i my hairs has grown over two inches and so you can get two inches of growth look at that wow from mini braids i'm pulling it there so you can see once again hit the subscribe button it's so easy to grow your natural hair long i'm showing you hair there are lots of promises on youtube about growing your natural hair potions and lotions which is good but i'm showing you a genuine fantastic way of growing your natural hair through patience you will need patience you will see a lot of results though and if mini braids is not for you i've got a mini twist playlist as well talking you through in detail how to grow your natural hair so once again subscribe not to miss out So just continuing the rest of the measurements i mean as i said you can see the growth there as i'm in my hair and i'm just searching for another hair to measure you can see all of that growth and not just the growth let's talk about the thickness for a minute because as you know my hair is low to medium density and i'm always looking for ways to thicken my natural hair and so i'm so happy that mini braids is giving me that thickness and of course the rest of my hair that hasn't been thick or has been damaged will look a lot thinner but i'm so excited to see the changes in my hair from mini braids and once again I, it is at the back of my mind that I might experience a lot more shedding as I do every fall but I'm still expecting to see a lot of difference in my hair having worn mini braids on my natural hair for a whole three months 12 weeks I know that there will be a lot of difference in my hair when I take these down so what you can expect from me then in the coming weeks you can expect the takedown you can expect my hair reveal because you're gonna see what my hair looks like outside mini braids you can actually see a length check and another challenge, I'm going to try and sneak in another challenge just before the year ends for you. It won't be mini braids. So stay tuned for that challenge. It's going to be so exciting um, as I continue to use my own oils and stuff that I'll be talking to, to you about a lot more in the coming year. I know that we can get fantastic growth and that's why I've dedicated so much time to this to show you how to grow your natural hair. Of course, for a lot of ladies like myself, if you've never had long hair, it's hard to stay motivated. And that is what the purpose of this channel is for. I hope you're getting great growth inspiration here. And if you are, do hit the like button. That really, really helps to push this uh, video up in the algorithm and help other ladies who's trying to grow their natural hair. Once again, I'd love to hear from you, your comments, how you found the challenge, how much growth you've got. Are you going to join another challenge? Are you looking forward? Do you want me to start another one? Just let me know down below in the comments and I'll be happy to hear from you, listen and respond. I know there's lots of questions talking about showing you how much um, breakage I receive, etc. And I'm listening to those. So when takedown comes, that will all be documented for you. So there you have my 12 week update. I'm really, really excited. I've got over two inches of growth from this set of mini braids and um, my hair is a lot thicker from this set of mini braids and i'm just so excited to see my hair out and loose thank you so so much for what i really really appreciate each and every one of you take care and i will see you in my next video bye bye